सो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइस टुडे आई टीच यू हाउ टू क्रिएट न्यू स्टाइल ऑफ 3D डी एब्स्ट्रैक्ट आर्ट शेप एनिमेशन विद यूजिंग एलिमेंट 3D डी प्लग इन सी गाइस दैट्स माय सिंपल एनिमेशन इट्स रियली क्रिएटिव एंड बी बेस्ट फॉर बिगिनर्स ओके सो गाइस नाउ आई टीच यू हाउ आई क्रिएट दिस टाइप ऑफ ब्यूटिफुल इफेक्ट that's my new composition check and guys preset use full hd frame and duration 15 second is good for me so press okay yeah and next one guys i take new solid layer and layer name like a e3d yeah and press okay okay so guys this time i apply element 3d plugin yeah and see guys that's my screen setup check yeah that's my setup okay so firstly guys I use motion design tool. That's my motion design. And guys, go to down and see guys. That's my different different style of objects. So guys, you can choose any one. So guys, I like this one. Yeah. So closer. That's my object. Okay. So guys, now I like more objects. So guys, go to our up and select yes. See guys, that's my object and composition. Okay, so guys, now I change color. This time, that's my chrome material. And guys, I change color like a red. So see guys, that's my chrome material. Physics and chrome material apply. Yes, and go to down. See guys, that's my material. And guys, this time go to on reflectivity color change. I like red color, red, dark red. Yes, so press okay. Yeah. See guys, that's my red color, and now guys, I apply same red color on this one wire, like this. Yeah, that's it, guys. Right? Okay. So now, guys, select your chrome material, and guys, little bit change color, like a uh, this one. Yes. So good. Okay. So now, guys, I apply this time rotated wheel effect. So guys, go to on here. Tech machine zero eight, yeah, and guys go to an up and scale size smaller, like this, yes, and guys go to an up, yeah. See guys, that's my wheel, and guys little bit more up, yes, it's good. Okay, so now guys this time go to on here scale size little bit change like a seventy two, yes, good, and now. Guys, duplicate. So press Control D and up and scale size change. Guys, this one scale size change like a fifty. Enter and up. Yes. See, guys, that's my simple object, right? Okay. So now, guys, I change this time aux channel. See, guys, that's my first one, first wheel, and that's my aux channel. To use channel one, and see guys, that's my second wheel. This one, second wheel, and aux channel change like a channel two. Yes, right. Okay, so now guys, all is good. This time, next one, I like plane. So guys, use plane and plane double sided check. And guys, I increase plane size like a twenty, twenty. Yeah. And guys, I change material. So guys, go to on pro shader, so metallic, and go to down. Guys, you can choose any material. So like this, yeah. And guys, I also change UV. So select this plane model, UV, UV repeat. I like ten and ten. Yeah, that's it, guys. Right? Okay. So guys, right click on this plane and reflection mode to use mirror surface. Yeah. Like this, yes, right. Okay, so now, guys, this time I change HDR texture. So, guys, go to an environment and go to on here backlight environment check and see, guys, that's my environment texture. So, check, yes. See, guys, that's my beautiful color, beautiful HDR texture, right? And guys, see, that's my light. So, use aqua. Yeah, guys, see that's my different different style. So guys, like this. Yeah, and guys, single light is also good. 
ओके सो नाउ गाइस माय ऑल कंपोजिशन इज गुड एंड नाउ गाइस गो टू ऑन हियर दैट्स माय ग्रुप सो गाइस क्लिक एंड ग्रुप फोल्डर गो टू डाउन यस एंड सी गाइस दैट्स माय सेकंड ग्रुप टू यूज सेकंड यस एंड नाउ गाइस सेलेक्ट योर प्लेन मॉडल सेलेक्ट एंड गो टू डाउन ऑन ग्रुप टू यस राइट सी गाइस दैट्स माय फर्स्ट ग्रुप only object guys first group only object and second group and only plane right okay so guys my all setting is finished now press okay yes and guys this time i take camera and camera check and guys rotate your camera so press c letter and closer like this so guys more and set your camera angle yes okay so guys select your e3d layer and guys go to on your render setting and lighting guys you can use any lighting but it's good all is good and go to on amb occlusion amb occlusion check guys quality i use high and radius i like 2 is good 2 yes that's it guys okay so guys now i create this time select your e3d more object so guys go to on here group 1 and particle so guys that's my replicator shape and use plane yes and so guys that's my count i like 25 is good yes that's it okay so guys now i go to on top view panel that's my top view panel and guys i change spacing so guys see that's my scale size increase so guys increase scale size like a 5 and 5 yes see guys that's my object guys little bit more like a 5.6 5.6 yes good see guys that's my spacing is good okay so guys go to on camera and active camera check yeah see guys that's my beautiful composition and now guys i create camera movement animation so guys go to on camera press c letter closer on mid one like this and guys little bit down yeah okay so guys select your camera and press p position check and go to on last one 15 second and guys camera rotation change like this yeah it's good so closer yeah see guys that's my camera movement animation so guys you can choose half resolution so guys go to on here that's my auto and guys press play yeah see guys that's my simple camera movement animation it's looking really good and next one guys i create rotation animation wheel rotation animation so guys all is good so stop and guys select your e3d layer so guys go to on here aux channel check and channel 1 and see guys that's my rotation rotation like this yeah and guys zero so guys now channel check and guys go to on last like a 15 second and channel like a 3 yes okay so guys go to back and play yeah it's good right okay so guys now you can increase fast so guys go to on last and channel rotation i like 4 and guys go to back and play yeah that's it guys that's my first rotation effect and next one guys go to back and guys go to on channel 2 yes and rotation check so guys rotation mid one check so minus 4 and guys this time go to last like a 50 second and like a zero yes so guys go to back and play and play yeah see guys that's my rotation effect it's looking really good right and guys go to back and one more time play yes okay so guys my all animation is finished it's looking really good and guys now guys stop and i apply this time light so guys go to a light and see guys that's my blue color 
so intensity 1000 is good so press ok yeah much better see guys that's my beautiful lighting simple side light right okay so guys lastly you can apply this time solid layer like a light to and press ok so guys go to on effect and this time i apply optical flare so guys press option okay so guys see that's my preset guys i have different different style of light presets you can choose anyone is dependent on your work select and open yeah and guys go to on side view yes and guys go to on mode to change add yes much better so and now guys go to on flicker and flicker amount like a 40 and 40 check yeah that's it guys okay so guys go to back and play yes see guys that's my final work it's looking really good and lastly guys you can also apply depth of field effect so guys i show you only one frame depth of field effect so guys go to on camera and camera option check and see guys that's my blur level i like like a hundred and focus distance check okay so guys select your camera press u guys manually change focus distance and guys focus like a 1000 enter yes and now guys go again go to camera and see guys that's my depth of field on yes so guys one more time select your camera and press u guys manually change focus distance like a 1200 yes guys more change yes good see guys that's my focus on mid and now guys go to on like a five second focus change like a 800 yes it's good and guys more change 900 yeah much better so guys go to on like a 10 second and focus distance like a 800 again guys change guys more change 900 yeah and lastly guys go to like a 15 second and focus change like a 1000 yes one yeah see guys that's my depth of field effect okay so guys go to back and play yeah that's it guys so guys that's it my final work is finished that's my 3d abstract shape design okay so guys that's it my final work is finished so if you like my video please share and please subscribe my youtube channel thank you